Hey everyone, I want to give a demo here on how to use URL scheme links in Notion. Uh, this is centered around the iOS, Mac OS, iPad OS, Apple ecosystem, uh, for Notion at least. And so these URLs, they're quite special. Um, they allow you to deep link and perform actions that a, another application might have. So in this case here, I have a URL scheme link for things. And what this is going to do is actually open up the My Test project. Um, unfortunately, Notion doesn't believe this is a valid URL, so you can't actually make it work in Notion. Um, but there's a way we can get around this. We can use the Tiny URL web service, which is a URL shortener. And what this will do is perform a redirect for us. And so we can essentially trick Notion. Um, I have a URL here, and this will actually open up that URL scheme link that I provided earlier. So let's do that. It opens the in-app browser and prompting us to open it in things. And when we do that, it opens it to my project, which is great. Now, we can also do other things. Um, I've made a, a iOS shortcut where it will assist me in making these links, essentially. Um, but conceivably, you can put any shortcut here, really. So here's another tiny URL uh, link that will run a shortcut for me. Now, this shortcut is going to prompt you to put in a URL scheme link for the sake of the video. I have it already pre-populated. Um, so this one here is going to, again, using things three, open it to the project, the possibilities. And what it does is opens up um, a connection to the tiny uh, URL service and gives you a link and puts it in your clipboard. So let's paste this in. And we have a new link here. And if we tap this, we can see that it opens it up to that project. So there really are uh, a lot of possibilities that can be done here using this technique. Um, I think it really opens up some integrations inside the Apple ecosystem with Notion. Uh, one thing that I haven't really explored yet, but I can see working out uh, very well is using these in the Notion collections or databases. So you can have a column which will have these links and so you can actually perform actions on them. Um, using uh, shortcuts, uh, it really opens up a lot of possibilities. You can have uh, you know, the ability of like a button essentially to fire a, a web request to an API. So I, I think there's a lot of possibilities here. Um, I hope you enjoy this and let me know what you uh, end up doing with it.